Hi, this is Amy from the Alti store. I'm going to give you a quick little tip on how to troubleshoot your solar system, your off-grid solar system, uh, up on the roof at the combiner box. Now, my system is not outputting the amount of power that I would have expected it to, so I need to figure out where the problem is and isolate it out. So I've turned off the breaker that is going into my charge controller back in my DC load center. So I have isolated this. This is completely separated from the rest of the system. I'm using an M MNPV3 to combine my solar panels in parallel. So I've got the negative from solar panel one and the negative from solar panel two going into my negative bus bar. I also have the negative from my multimeter in there. Now I've got the positive from each of my solar panels going into their own breaker. If I had multiple panels in, in a string, in series string, I would have each string in their own. So I'd be able to narrow down where my problem is to a specific string. Since I only have two panels in parallel, I'm going to be very, it's going to be very easy to find out where my problem is. So I'm expecting to get about uh, maybe just under 20 volts out and about 0.6 amps out of this system. Now when I measure the combined output, so I've got my, my two breakers in here and they are combined with my positive bus bar, I'm seeing I've got 0.47 amps. Now I, I should have been seeing 0.6, so where's my problem coming from? Now I've got my multimeter set to measure DC amps I've got my positive lead in the correct socket here, so this is something you need to have a multimeter that's able to measure DC amps. Now I'm going to turn off my breakers. This is something you can do if you have DC breakers that are rated to be able to turn off under load. You do not want to do this with fuses. If you've got fuses in your, in your combiner box, you can't do this, okay? You do not want to disconnect your fuses under load when the, when the sun is shining on them. So because I've got this disconnected and I've got breakers, I can turn off the breakers. So I'm going to measure the input of breaker one. So I'm measuring from solar panel two, I'm getting 0.3 amps. That's what I'd expect. From solar panel one, I'm getting 0.16 amps. Something's wrong with that solar panel. So by isolating it from all the others through the breakers, I'm able to detect where my problem is. So I've got something wrong with solar panel one. I hope this was helpful. If it was, give us a like and a share and uh, subscribe to our channel here at Alti Store so we'll notify you when new videos come out. Also go to our website, altistore.com, where we've been making renewable doables since 1999.